Hi everybody, welcome to Northwood Farms vlog entry number 54. And I'm Emma. I'm Kip. This is Wills. And it's December 29th. 2013. Yeah, the very last one of this year. Yes, this is last vlog of 2013. On with 2014. Yeah, that's good. New Year's in two days. Yeah, we got our start of our resolutions, endless possibilities, all kinds of fun. Yeah, I love the New Year because it just seems like anything can happen. I mean, the possibilities seem to be totally endless, and um, it's a it just gives me an optimistic feeling. I love it. That's good. So I love having some goals, and I do this weird thing with goals. Some people do better if they have goals that are really hard to achieve. Um, Lisa Overhuel, I think you're one of those. <laughs> and um, I personally do better if they're, um, you know, not not super easy to the point where I don't take them seriously, but easy enough that I can or possible enough that I can do it so I don't feel overwhelmed, and then I end up overshooting them. So it's interesting. Everybody has different things that work for them. That is interesting. And some people don't like goals at all. They feel like it. it I like a challenge. Yeah, yeah. Give me I, a big challenge. <laughs> Kip does pretty good with challenges that are hard <laughs> to achieve as well. Yeah. So, so anyway, we... So the challenge, we need to talk really okay. quickly about the challenge, we'll the challenge because we're so excited to have so many people joining us. Um, but don't forget, you need to post your picture of you and your horse and Rochelle. It includes you and your horse. and you Not have a to, shadow. <laughs> not a shadow <laughs> picture. It has to be a picture of you and your horse. And you need to post it on the Facebook wall by midnight on Saturday, this Saturday. And then we begin one week from now. It's pretty cool. And people had a question, right, Kip? Yeah, they were just asking about the 40 hours 30 horsemanship rides. Well, it's it's horsemanship hours, but 30 rides, that counts towards your 40 horsemanship yeah, hours. Yeah, yeah. So of it's 30 riding, rides in your 40 hours. Yeah, because riding is always horsemanship. Obviously, yeah. you need your horse to stay in your rectangle. You're providing them peace. You're still the leader. You can't ever, you don't ever want to check out. So, yes, 40 hours total, which includes 30 rides, five of which can be bareback. That's pretty and that'll cool. be in 12 weeks. Yeah, so that's yeah. really exciting. Yeah. And what else? Oh, my gosh. We got the biggest news yesterday. Well, you saw it, and you we'd been hearing about it for a little while, but we didn't really realize what it I was. I had no clue. But um, it's starting to build up more momentum. But uh, it's called... Wallace Bridge. Wallace Bridge and Equestrian can, yeah, Facility. It's, well, no. It's just wallacebridge.com um, if you want to look it up on the internet. And um, you can type in Wallace Bridge in Facebook and it should come up as well. But it is going to be 10 minutes from here. 10 minutes from Northwood. And it's going to be an international level equestrian facility with two lodges. And um, a Grand Prix dressage arena, Grand Prix warm-up, two polo fields, three indoor arenas, four outdoor arenas, a full cross-country course. Yep. It's going to be amazing. It's, amazing. It's pretty huge. And they're, um, they're so serious about it, and they're putting all this behind it. it. They included it as the equestrian site. They have a proposal for the equestrian site if um, Portland gets the Olympics, um, which 2020. I believe they're trying to bid for in 2024, yeah. yeah. So, I mean, that's that's the level at which this is planned, and, and you'll see all the plans for it if you go to the website. It's it's incredible. Seriously, 10 minutes it's from here. It's over the hill. The hill right behind minutes. us. 10 minutes. That hill right there, yeah. <laughs> it's the other it. side it's of that so hill. Great. So if I didn't know about it, then I know a ton of you guys didn't know about it either. So if you could share the page, that would be great because um, there's a small issue with some wetlands designation. They need to get it redesignated because the creator yeah. has generally generously offered to double the size of the wetlands in actually a better area with more species of plants and wildlife. Yeah, um, they had a, a big portion of it that was dry that was designated wetlands on the corner of the wetlands. But... Um, you know, it really wasn't good use for the wetlands. Well, whatever. It, I think it's a, it's a small issue. We just need to get we just need to get it resolved, and so um, all the community support we can put behind it is uh, will be great. We're so <laughs> excited. That's so huge. So, anyway, that's the news from here, basically. Yeah, there's lots of stuff going on first yeah. of the year. Yeah, so everyone make your goals. And um, I heard today, too, that if you aren't striving for something, you're basically committing spiritual suicide, <laughs> which is quite an extreme That's statement. That's pretty... 
<laughs> yeah. But um, that's deep stuff. It's kind of deep, yeah, for sure. It's kind of along the lines of what we're talking about in the pursuit, which is you know quantum entanglement and oh my gosh, stuff that's really over my head for sure. But anyway, we'll let you guys go. We hope you have an amazing week and happy new year. All right, we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.